never leave them with caregivers, never leave them with babysitters. And that's the way it is. And if they can't handle them themselves, then don't leave them any place where there's a pool. Now at five, a child tragedy now under investigation in San Jose after two children drowned at a daycare that has a backyard pool. A third child pulled from the pool is expected to survive. Good evening. I'm Julie Hayner. And I'm Mike Meebeck, KTV reporter Henry Lee, live tonight in the South Bay with the very latest on the story. Henry? Yeah, Mike and Julie, San Jose police are trying to determine exactly what led up to this backyard tragedy that left two children dead and a third at the hospital. Two children died and a third was being treated at a hospital in a drowning incident at a San Jose home serving as a daycare facility. San Jose firefighters were called to the home on Fleetwood Drive at about 9 in the morning. They quickly realized that three children had apparently fallen into the backyard pool. All three children were taken to hospitals. Two of them were pronounced dead. The third is expected to recover. Firefighters requested that police also respond. Police officers and investigators came on the scene. Police have not yet said what led up to the tragedy. Authorities said about five other children at the daycare were accounted for. I've learned the tragedy happened at the Happy Happy Daycare. Its website says it's a licensed home daycare that is, quote, following all safety protocols. I texted the owner but did not get a response. Her website says she has a bachelor's degree in child development. That's totally unacceptable. Three children at the same time? What the heck? We're, we're, we're with parents or the caregivers. I spoke to Nadina Rigsby, president of the Drowning Prevention Foundation. In 1978, her two-year-old drowned in her Danville home while under the care of a babysitter. They should never leave their children any place with this any form body of water at all. Unless they're there, hands on, eyes on. Now, San Jose police are investigating this along with the Santa Clara County DA's office. Live in San Jose, Henry Lee, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Hey, Henry, do we know how many people are actually working at that facility and whether or not there is a, a, a gate around the pool at least here? Yeah, there appears to be a gate based on some uh, footage, but again, we don't know if the state authorities indeed sign off on that or if there were some remaining issues with that pool, but suffice it to say it was licensed as, and as far as we know. And we don't know how many people there at the scene who were working on this particular morning? Correct. We don't know yeah. who was involved, how many there were, and exactly how many children each was responsible for and uh, what the parameters were. Tragic story there in San Jose. Henry Lee live for us tonight. Henry, thank you.